वेलकम टू यू योर सिगा एस ए यूट्यूब चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब चैनल फॉर मोर वीडियोस एंड टू गेट द रियल टाइम सपोर्ट फॉर फ्यू डेज टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट क्रॉस सेलिंग व्हाट द क्रॉस सेलिंग इफ यू वांट टू सेल एनी सब मटेरियल अलोंग विद द मेन मटेरियल ओके वी आर गोइंग टू यूज द टॉपिक ऑफ क्रॉस सेलिंग ओके वी विल सी हाउ इट विल वर्क इन एस Okay. Now, I'm, for example, I'm creating one sale order. I'm creating one sale order now. So, for this customer, whenever I am selling this 60 material along with the 60, I want to sell 99 material. Okay. Along with the sell, whenever I enter 60, a default system has to take the 99. So, along with the 60, I want to sell 99. So. In this case, how we have to do the config backend? We will see now. The T code to the configuration, SPRO, sales and distribution, sales and distribution, basic functions, cross selling. Here, define determination procedure for cross selling. Click on this first. We have to, we have to same like it is like same like a pricing procedure. Uh, pricing now we are creating the pricing tables. The tables we are placing in axis sequence, axis sequence. We are uh, assigning to condition type, condition types. We are placing pricing procedure same like that. First we have to define the table uh, tables. Okay, here already I am going to use the standard table. So I am creating, I am copying the standard through C double zero one. I am created my own cross selling axis sequence. See that was the zero double one table. So material. So I am going to the same material. I am not creating any new. So okay, now I am saving axis sequence created, cross selling axis sequence created. This cross selling axis sequence I am going to assign in cross selling condition type. So I am going to create the new cross selling condition type Y one C one. For this one, I am going to assign my axis sequence just now whatever I created for cross selling. Now I am saving. Now I am going back. This cross selling condition type I am going to. Place in cross selling procedure. Okay, here I am going. I am creating my own procedure. Y one C one double zero cross selling procedure. Here I am going to place in cross selling condition types. Whatever I created. Y one C one. Okay, now I am saving. After created cross selling procedure, this cross selling procedure we need to assign cross selling profile. Okay. In next tab, okay. In next after that we have the one more maintain customer document procedures for cross selling. Just click on that. Define cross selling. Already the first one we have the customer procedure for product proposal and customer uh, procedure for cross selling. So in pricing level, we have the customer uh, customer pricing procedure and document pricing procedure. Same like that, customer cross selling procedure, customer cross selling document cross selling procedure. So this is the uh, standard ones. You want to create your own cross selling procedure. So uh, I'm creating C with the cross selling. Now I'm saving. So what is this one? C. This is for customer. This is for customer level. Same like that we have over uh, document type level. So document customer cross selling. So I save. So we I created one 
customer cross selling procedure i mean customer cross selling procedure and document cross selling procedure two i created now i am going to assign to my sales document type y over here i i am going to assign c just now whatever i created document cross selling procedure for document so that i assign i save now i am going back define and assign cross selling profiles first i have to create cross selling profile i am going to new entries so what is my cross selling profile y1 c1 double zero is my cross selling profile for this one i am going to assign my cross selling procedure y1 c1 double zero save i am going back this i am going back this cross selling profile i am going to assign combination so this is my sales are distribution channel division okay yo10 is my sales organization yd is my distribution channel yr is my division okay customer cross selling customer procedure c customer document procedure c my cross selling profile y1 c1 00 now i am saving okay now i am going back to customer xd02 so for this customer i want to create the sale order so in this customer master level sales area tab okay in here c sales tab here i am going to maintain c just what just now order i created so in proposal customer procedure here we have to assign now i'm saving okay now i'm creating one sale order so first of all we have to make a condition records for cross selling that t code is vb41 what is our uh, what is our cross selling procedure the condition type y1 c1 your material whenever i am selling 60 along 60 i want to sell 99 this is our requirement right unit of measurements each now i am saving this is valid from valid to this is valid till this date now i am creating sale order for the customer see whenever i enter 60 material okay whenever i enter 60 material automatically will get the pop up so we have to do one config for this one it uh, item kind determination let me do the copy uh, let me do the item kind determination already right, done back in the sheet scheme i will show you that how it will how it will be go to the t code vo before item kind determination okay go to position what is our sales document type yor document type see item category group norm for this one what is the item category yor right this is for header 60 material for 99 material yor norm what is the item item usually for cross selling jet is called uh, it is for c something will come csl something will come for cross selling csl okay higher level item category for 60 material what item category is coming y over right so to y over we have to enter for this one default item category i am going to assign y over so this is this is for 99 material previous is for 60 material now i am saving so now i am creating sale order so i copied tan i created a y over so y over i copied from tan see this is item proposal okay now i am creating delivery I'm doing the picking and PGA. Now I'm doing PGA. Now I'm creating invoice for the sale order. Now I'm saving. Okay. This is the configuration and process of cross selling. Once again, thank you for all your time. 
please subscribe channel for more videos to get the real time free support for few days next class i am going to cover otc process once again thank you all for your time